so we'll work on uh, this issue today so let's read it what exactly he's saying uh, prevent hash content overlap with double sidebar okay so I'm using bootstrap to create a web page with two fixed sidebars and a footer okay i got the sidebars and footers position appropriately but having problems keeping the hash content from overlapping the sidebars and footer objective the content width and height should shrink based on the sidebar width and footer height okay so we'll check this link later but uh, first we'll see what exactly he's saying so he's saying like uh, we have one web page like this and uh, he wanted one footer should be fixed okay so this is footer and uh, he wanted one left sidebar and one right sidebar okay so this is the content area this should expand or shrink according to the size of the devices okay so okay so what link he's showing here we'll check this link uh, okay okay so here he's saying uh, he added banner we'll check how it is the structure of the code what he did so we'll see here okay so one is wrapper and uh, wrapper is like full body is covering this is the main diff and inside that div uh, we have nav nav tag with left sidebar this is left and uh, this one is the right sidebar and in the middle it's the content so left and right sidebar is overlapping the content part and uh, what's about the footer we'll check footer is at the right place but this is also overlapping okay what we'll do is we'll work on this code okay so we'll open this where is that okay mm -hmm. So this is all his code. We'll work on this code only. We'll not create our own. So we'll copy the snippet. And okay. So this is his code. We'll run this. Uh, add it. We'll edit this. Okay. First we'll run how it's coming. So this is the thing he was doing here. The bottom part is coming differently at the right side. I don't know exactly what's the matter here. Okay, leave it. So I will try to do here in the inspect element. Okay. So this is the main dev so main div should cover all the space so if you can see um, some padding uh, some kind of white space is coming here if you see okay so what we'll do is we'll add css here like body margin zero it's the browser property default margin will come so we have to do like this okay if you run this now i think it will cover that space yeah exactly it's working now and uh, okay uh, let's see uh -huh. so this is the wrapper it's covering full body okay so this is the left size First, we'll fix that bottom bottom part, that footer part. What they have written for the bottom. Okay, here nothing is written, but in the code, 
okay in the code also nothing is there on the footer red is there so we'll do one thing okay we'll do is mm, okay position should be should be absolute so we'll make everything absolute okay so what we'll do is mm, footer sidebar yeah first is footer footer comma sidebar sidebar and what else is there content hash content content everything should be position absolute will find something is disturbing now <laughs> everything is disturbed everything is overlapping each other so what we'll do here is mm, okay so first we'll fix the position of footer okay this is fixed this is bottom and see because we want it at the bottom and for example we will add background hash zero 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 so bottom should be background should be like this and width should be 100 percent okay so now if you see bottom is fixed now okay so yeah mm -hmm. now the site part done position we already made it fixed and uh, I don't think this is required that will do it later for the time being we'll delete it yeah left should be zero and uh, we'll add some fixed width here width should be always 200 pixel okay and uh, the top should be zero okay so we'll add some kind of color here um, what color background should be uh, hash ccc like gray gray thing we added oh so it's not visible mm, i think we removed height also which be ics to height c a l c hundred percent minus forty eight pixel this should work not working okay where is the uh, inspected where exactly it is so here it is coming i think it's it's the behind behind the content part yeah yeah it should because it's coming before if you see the html here uh, first this one then the content is coming so content will overlap this left sidebar so we have to give some kind of uh, layer this should come second there so we'll add z index one so it will come over the content area so now you can see yes so our left bar is coming here so 150 i will give 150 pixel width 
okay so yeah this is coming this is overlapping actually uh, not a problem we'll do it later the rest part and uh, then the right side bar will do the same thing okay so here right should be because it should come right side so the right right zero down everything is correct and if you check yeah it's coming at the right side but still both of the uh, right side bar and the right side uh, left side bar both are overlapping the content part so what we have to do is uh, first and uh, this set in set index is not required okay so content area so where is the content okay so this is the content mm -hmm. okay so it should be height should be this is height and for width it should be like this Mm. 150 we added for left 150 added for right so it should be 300 pixel 300 pixel correct and uh, adding well, okay fine it's okay and this one also should be like this okay now if you check mm, run yeah so 100 oh, view we have to write 100 percent actually yeah so it's behind that left bar we have to because the position is uh, 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 left zero maybe by default it will come start from left so what we'll do is here as 200 is a fixed value uh, for that left bar what we'll do is we'll, we'll do left 150 pixel correct so it will come there hmm. and uh, what's happening okay we added padding also so yeah so it means I think we don't require this right now padding will add later okay so everything is coming perfectly fine left side bar right side bar and this content area so I think this is almost the solution but some space is coming some white space is coming here okay so this is 36 pixel mm, it will restrict the height also here footer so where is the footer part sidebar is there footer huh? here is the footer will add height the rgst height equal to 40 pixel and uh, we'll change all the things here should be 40 here also it should be 40 yeah and now if we check yep it's perfectly fine here also it's with that correct so everything is pretty fine here if we collapse also uh, if we reduce the size of this box then 100% minus 300 because 300 is always there and here was some here he added some padding we will add that here like we can add the here with glass 
adding two and uh, we'll close this remove this okay so the padding padding is not coming let's check why oh okay the bootstrap he has not added here so we have to write our own css there so we'll write here content wrapper and we'll use this class here to add some padding padding 15 pixel okay so if we check now here the padding is also coming thank you for watching please like the video and comment if you have other idea subscribe the channel if you want to see more web technology videos